such an interesting and volatile year for fixed income investors. So we have the end of QE. We have the waiting around for when the Fed is going to raise rates. How should the fixed income investor view the market now, especially heading into 2015? Well, we think uh, rates will trend slightly up into the end of the year. And then as we go into 2015, we really believe that uh, the short end of the yield curve will feel the pressure from anticipating a Fed funds rate increase, which we think will happen in the first half of 2015. Hmm. All right, so where do you see the 10 year at the end of this year? Uh, we think it'll probably end up somewhere around the 2.5% area uh, at the end of this year, kind of a slight trend up from the 235 area from today. Uh, we envision some profit taking between now and the end of the year, uh, which would not be surprising. We've had a tremendous total return year in the bond market. And why do you see the Fed moving in the first quarter? Not everyone is in agreement with that. Some people think the Fed will push it out a little bit more. Well, we think it may happen in the first quarter, but it'd probably be at the end of the first quarter, but likely sometime in the first half, maybe into the June time frame. And the reason being is that we're getting ever closer to, I think, what is their kind of target on the employment rate. 5.8 right now, headed towards 5.5. And I think when it hits that 5.5 area and it's coupled with a little bit of wage growth, I think the Fed will feel comfortable in raising that Fed funds rate.